Welcome to this Specialty Products installation video for the 67645 adjustable rear camber arm. This arm is designed to provide rear camber adjustment on the 2008 and newer Subaru Impreza including the WRX and STI and will adjust rear camber by plus or minus 1.5 degrees. Please follow all safety precautions associated with equipment used to install this product. Raise and support the vehicle by the frame so the rear suspension hangs free. Remove the tire and wheel assembly. Remove the three bolts retaining the lower control arm to the frame, the strut, and the hub assembly. Remove the arm from the vehicle. After assembling the arm per the instruction sheet, install the arm into the vehicle. Make sure to use the correct length bolt in each location. Tighten only the outer hub bolt at this time. Reinstall the tire and wheel assembly and lower the vehicle. Now tighten the strut retaining bolt and the frame bushing bolt. With the two clamping bolts loose, camber change is made by rotating the cam nut. Loosen and adjust the stock toe adjuster. On this type of suspension, toe and camber have an effect on each other and are adjusted together. If camber cannot be brought into desired specifications, it will be necessary to install the provided offset toe bushing. The toe bushing will increase the amount of camber correction by extending the range of the toe link. Start by removing the toe link from the vehicle. Remove the cotter pin and nut, then using a tie rod separator tool, break the taper on the toe link. Remove the bolt from the inner end, then pull the hub outward to remove the arm. Press out the stock bushing using the 40920 ball joint press or equivalent along with the 67646 bushing press adapter tool. For positive camber change, install the bushing so the hole in the bushing is towards the ball end of the arm. If negative camber change is desired, install the bushing so the hole is away from the ball end. Reinstall the toe link in reverse order of removal.
An optional tow adjustable link, part number 67655, is available if even more camber and tow range is needed. This arm is installed the same as the stock tow link, but has an adjustable turnbuckle for rear tow adjustment. Make sure to tighten the lock nuts after adjustment. After all camber and tow adjustments have been made, tighten all the fasteners. Torque the two clamping bolts to 55 pound-feet. Reset front toe and road test the vehicle.